Prey will provide the initiation, and there is a really good team fight comp on the side of Rocks Tigers. The speed boost from Karma will answer a lot of Sipper's movement speed. But again, the split push, I think, is the real story. Full hardy. That wave's gonna come through TP as well. Uh -oh. On the hunt gets popped, and Prey and Gorilla don't have much of anywhere to go. Coco be looking straight for the Ash. He throws the arrow in the face of Fury, but he gets out of that stun very quickly. And he's gonna go down. That's gonna be. First blood over to Coco. Now Chaser arrived on the bottom side. Smeb with a whole lot of places to run to. Throws up the Subjugate. Going to look to flash over the wall into the Dragon Pit. Is able to do so with the bubbles there. Nice. From here, nicely played. They get the pop up. And that's going to be the kill on the backswing of the Boomerang. And Fury. However, I'm going to try and harass him down. Has Hema Plague available? He's looking for it. Throws it out. Here okay. comes Peanut as well. Too much damage comes through. He does repost the Cocoon, but it doesn't matter. Flashes away. Cry chases. Gets him with the Tides of Blood. And smacked. And uh, he'll also get ganked. He's just trying to go all in on doing special flashes in for the flash. Is mirrored by the Fiora. Locked up underneath the tower, taking a hell of a lot of damage. And Smab, not sure if he's going to be able to equalize any kind of trade here. No flash available, nowhere for him to go. He's going to fall down, and Coco finds the kill. Fury and Pure rotate over to stop Cry from being able to rocks. Still find the kill onto the dragon. Coco gonna get hit up by that arrow, but here comes Chaser knocking up several members of Tidal Wave on the backside. Bubble not gonna connect. It's gonna be Coco going down already as Peanut picks up the kill. And here comes Expression on the backside. Cry, Gorilla, Prey, and Peanut all very low. They jump into Gorilla. The shield comes through from Karma, but the Ricochet is able to take him out on the backside. Expression falls, however, under this pressure that Cry is laying down with the Vladimir. And now Fury and Pure have to run, but Smab is still a very big troll. He's just walking up onto the Sivir, who has all of nowhere to go. Cry running over, trying to confirm the kill with the transfusion, just can't get range. So Smab going to go ahead and chomp him out. Prey going into the Peanut, dives underneath the tower, has the Repel, gets out safely. But at this stage where he's just trying to finish the item now, it's not going to be good. Gorilla on the run, has that speed up, will dodge out the bubble. Expression coming around as well, throws out the Grand Challenge, gets popped up in the air. He's going to go down. Thero comes through from the bottom side, locks up Chaser. Expression still has that Hemo Plague tick mixing. Confirmed here. Oh, Smep really far forward. Here comes Chaser, pops out the pillar to try to buy himself some time. Peanut's arriving as well. The Cocoon's not going to land, and Expression is really low, but the TP is coming through now from Coco. He's going to be a very fast rise. Zips over the wall, but he can't get in range in the end to get the kill. Pure with nowhere to go. Throws out the Tidal Wave in an act of desperation. Cry jumps forward, has the Proto Belt. Can he get the kill? Yes, he can. The arrow comes through for good measure, but it doesn't need to connect. Coco now getting jumped on by Smeb and Peanut. They pursue this one. Brace coming around the top side. No arrow, obviously, as it was just used. Cry goes in deep, throws out the Hemo play. Coco gonna get butt by the cocoon. He's gonna go down. Prey. Eat of the old Longju. They're fighting, and even though there's no way for Fury to be there, he was in the bot lane. He was gonna get a turret instead. He watches as multiple members over pursue. They could have just kited back and gotten out, but they turned back in. That was the wrong call. Well, Jason's Baron's gonna go low. in. He's gonna try to get the steal, but he's just too damn low. He gets burned out immediately. Peanut finds the kill and will find the smite on the bear. Well, you know, you could get the Rylize. Or he's getting that you get too. the Proto Belt. Or both. Or why not both? Why not? Both? Hooray! Look at this though. Smep. Just stomping out Fury. Finding that solo kill. Coco just not where he should be. He's gonna go down. That's gonna be the tier two in the mid side. Baron empowered minions there for themselves at the 28 minute mark. Prey just zoning everybody off with the volley. See, even on the expression, he's just doing a hell of a lot of damage. Might not be able to finish the inhibitor just now, though. We do see Longju put up another contest. Well, Prey is going to walk forward. Expression goes in. He gets knocked up there by the Rek'Sai, but it doesn't even matter. Three kills very quickly being answered. A triple kill. Actually, no, it's just a double kill plus the inhibitor there for Prey. Screw it. We'll call it a triple kill anyway. That's going to be the ace, and that's going to be the game as Rocks Tigers 2 0 over Longju, shutting down their surprising performance that we saw them have against Samsung.